Hey, what's good, everybody? Welcome back to Thirsty Thursdays and today's cocktail. Now, normally I do a poll to decide what we're gonna do, but last week's poll was so close between espresso martini and something original that since we went with something original, I figured I'd be nice and do the espresso martini. Now, before we get into that, as always, do me that favor, like, subscribe, follow, and make sure you hit that notification bell so that you don't miss any of these great cocktails. Now, I don't know why you guys are super excited about this cocktail. It is what it is, but we're gonna do it because I wanna give you what you want. But this cocktail was like really popular when I first started bartending way back a long time ago. But for whatever reason, it is back, it's popular, people love it, so we're gonna make one. Our ingredients today, we've got simple syrup that we made. Very easy, if you guys need a video on that, drop it down in the comments. I'll make all kinds of syrups for you guys. We'll teach you how if you want to, let me know. We've got our freshly brewed espresso, we've got some vodka, and then normally it's Kahlua, but today we're gonna to be using Belle Isle Moonshine. Don't get all weirded out by the moonshine. This is an easy drinking, sipping moonshine uh, that is just really, really good. This is their cold brew coffee moonshine. Now, this martini is gonna be maybe slightly lighter than what you might be used to, but it's still gonna be really good. It's gonna have a lot of great flavor, and plus, I just really like this coffee moonshine. I don't like coffee in general, I don't like hot beverages, but this right here, that I'll drink on the rocks, neat, whatever. It's a great sipping moonshine, coffee flavor. They've got a whole line of products, check them out. I'll drop their website down in the description box below. So, let's get into our cocktail. We need our shaker. We'll start with our vodka. We're gonna go two ounces of vodka. Two ounces of vodka. We just need a half ounce. If you get a little extra in there, that's fine. Half ounce of our coffee liqueur, our cold brew moonshine here. So, we're gonna take a half ounce of our simple syrup. And then our freshly brewed espresso. We need one ounce of this. Go. And then of course, this is a shaken cocktail. We wanna make sure we shake this really, really hard. That's what's gonna give us that nice, frothy, foamy top. So, we get a little ice. We give this a good shake. And this in a coupe glass, not a martini glass, works just as well. I don't think I own any martini glasses. Plus I don't really like martini glasses. I prefer the coupe. Look at that. Beautiful. So I'll give that just a second. Let that foam sort of set there. And then we're gonna garnish with three coffee beans for health, wealth, and happiness. And that's our espresso martini. Cheers. <sighs> Super good, easy. Like I said, this Belle Isle cold brew moonshine is fantastic. So again, do me that favor, like, subscribe, and follow, and we'll see you guys next week for Thirsty Thursday. Until the next dish, y'all.